are being extremely lazy this morning. We had all sorts of plans what we were going to do this morning, but it is now lo no longer the morning. It's like 12 o'clock now. Um, I'm not really quite sure what's happened. We were. I was supposed to get up early and go for a run and while I was on my run I was going to run past the laundrette and collect the washing that we took in yesterday because we have no clothes to wear other than what we wore yesterday so that was what I was supposed to be doing but instead I mean I don't think I was late to sleep last night after the fireworks we were, we were reasonably early but I did get woken up by like half past five this morning by someone who doesn't seem to realise the time difference between England and Hong Kong but it was it was um it was a nice wake up call so I'm not complaining about it. And then I've just been kind of faffing ever since. I did fall back asleep again at about half past ten for half an hour or so. And I've just been doing a little bit of work and I've decided now I need to get up and go and have a shower. I'm absolutely starving. We need some food. I think the weather might be kind to us today. I've had a little look. It does say that it is due storms. But when I look out the window, it looks quite nice. I'm going to hop in the shower now, get myself organised and sorted. I felt a little bit rough this morning after having a few beers last night. In fact, I felt very rough this morning, but I'm all sorted now, I feel fine now. <laughs> we have made our way out, we're just now wandering the back streets trying to find the laundrette that we took our clothes to. I have no idea whether it's this street or whether it's the one along. Should have paid more attention when we were dropping them off. That was a bit silly, really. We'll find it, eventually. That was so much easier than I thought it was going to be. It's just there. They've lost our clothes, they can't find them. No! We got our clothes back, nice fresh laundered clothes, we are no longer going to stink. We're going to just go and take them back to the hotel now and then we're going to go and grab some lunch before we head over. We're going to um, Victoria Peak later on, so get some lunch and head over there. That's the laundry dropped off. I'm going to go and get some lunch, you hungry Stephen? Yeah. Starving. Yeah. You too. On to the MTR. Oh, We've just got off the MTR. We're on Hong Kong Island now. When you got the metro, there's these nice little gardens. Ch Chatter Gardens, I think they're called. It's just a short walk, I think, to where we get the tram up Victoria Peak. You can just see it there between the buildings. You go up there on a tram. Oh my goodness. It is chocker here. Absolutely chocker. Peak tram ticket purchase. I'm not entirely sure this is something I want to do. It's cute. It goes on for ages and ages to get tickets. Oh my god. We just started queuing. 3.31. See how long this takes us. We're at the front of this little queue. We've got to cross the road in a second into the other queue. It is... 16.16. Four past four. Forty-five minutes of queuing so far. It's actually gone quite fast. It's not too bad. These are our little tickets to cross the road to join the next queue. Where do we go? We got our tickets. And it's twenty past four, so it's about fifty odd minutes queuing. Not too bad, I suppose.
I dropped my phone on the floor and it went like all the way back there, like eight days back. Check out these views. Oh my goodness. Found a sweet shop. Oh, should we get some jelly bellies? Mmm. Oh, we're looking forward to some sweets. Mmm. Some of these. Get off. Yeah. You sure you like them? Not too many. Yeah, that's enough. Get some of these. I love these. Look at these, it's a can. Jelly Belly. Jelly Belly. Beer flavour. Whoa. This scares me a little bit, the whole height thing. Don't like it. Oh, don't lean over. Jesus. Mm -hmm. Sweet. It might not be Haribo tongue plastics, but oh my goodness. people this is the queue weaving in and out in and out in and out and it goes all the way over there oh my god so potentially we might have a plan we did buy a return ticket for the tram but we don't think it can be that long of a walk it didn't seem that long in the tram so we're gonna have a little look and see how long it's gonna take to walk because it's starting to spit a little bit yikes oh look it's started Okay, walking was a completely ridiculous idea, it would take us forever 
supposed to walk there. But we have just had a little can there is buses, I think. So we're gonna go and see if we can find the bus stop. without ending the vlog i'm going to bed now i'm gonna get into bed and i am just editing back there so i'm gonna get into bed and continue with the edit thanks for watching today hope you've had a wonderful day whatever you've done tomorrow is our last day in hong kong i'm gonna be sad to leave but on to better things maybe not better things on to new things right thanks for watching guys bye